son Tony, and we were a custom boat builder, Barndale Boat Works out of Stewart, Florida. We specialize in high-end center consoles and express sport fishing. And this is one of our featured boats, and I'll let Tony tell you about it. It's one thing that makes us unique is we're low volume. Uh, so we do just like a boat or two a year. Everything's built to order, so a customer comes in and gets to lay out a project the entire way they'd like it. You guys want to take a walk through? Okay, great. Let's do that. Thank you. So when you say custom built, is this like what is the main frame of this? Is it based on another? Brand? It's, it's something that was actually entirely laid out. Oh, so everything. It's not like we've taken another brand and said, okay, let's just kind of no, change it around or from something. From scratch. So from scratch. Wow, that's yeah. very interesting. So it's got big electronics. Yeah. How's it holding on? With magnets? Yeah, just like oh. your iPad cover. Okay, that's cool. It's got the I same understand. feature where if you throw them up there, it puts the screens to sleep as well. Uh, carbon fiber dash. Everything's kind of super clean. One thing that makes us unique is it's seamless. If you look around, we actually fiberglass the entire boat together and then come through and hand finish and paint it. So it's not just a bunch of parts that come out of molds and get glued together. As a matter of fact, on this boat, all we had was a hull mold and a cap mold. So everything you see here was hand shaped, finished out. So it's a lot of labor, but it's perfect when it's done. Even though everything's low profile, uh, great line of sight from up here. There's a huge interior. Nice seating area in the front here. Now, the, okay, so this part, so we're all like enclosed right now. So even weather-wise, we're not going to get wet anywhere in here. Yeah, and there's a huge air conditioning system for oh, the wow. bridge. So it's all climate controlled. And then what about the back? Is there anything that, like, like anything you're able to drop in the back if it was really yeah, heavy weather? Yeah, we have the ability to do a soft wall for the back. Okay. Uh, it's not as popular down south, but up north where we do a heater oh. for up here. Oh, yeah. It's more common to see that. I can see that. Okay, let's go down and see. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, so this little lounge room here. Wow, yeah screen yeah, this nice comfy couch screen. very nice and then inside this wall it's actually a trap door and there's an insert that drops in here and this becomes a queen mattress oh wow mm -hmm. so this boat was really set up more for cruising um, but if you wanted to overnight on it you have the ability to these are all the controls for all the electrical yeah it's all the breaker panels Then it's got a small kitchenette. Oh, yeah. Refrigerator. Little single burner stove, microwave. And then this also can convert to a sleeping area, I'm assuming, right? The yep. table would go down. This drops down. And then behind that wall, we have the cushions. Oh, that's really behind that wall. Mm -hmm. That's wow. Try to hide everything. That's, you know? Yeah, that's very, nice I was wondering clean. where that would be. Mm -hmm. And what do we have over here? Oh, another TV another over TV. here. That's nice. Mm -hmm. And what about down here? Storage area? Yep, yeah, storage down below. There's storage a. Above. Yes, the cedar line. Oh, beautiful. Locker. Yeah. Oh, it smells lovely. Yeah. It smells, yeah. That's, okay, full size head here. Shower, everything that you need. This is a lovely boat. We'll see what else we have on the top deck. Yeah, we'll go back up and out and around. That's good with you. You've got handles everywhere to help you get up. So this sunroof, when it's powered, yes, it actually turns white like this. Oh, okay. So it's photo, like photoelectric glass. Mm -hmm. I love that. Does yeah. that also retract? It doesn't on this one. Okay. But of course, since you do things customized, if somebody wanted that feature, you could always, you could always anything somebody on wants. Yeah. An outdoor grilling station. Oh yeah, this is very nice. <laughs> More storage underneath. Yeah, so it's is there like a any kind of fridge or cooler. Um, there's two fridges up on the. Up on the bridge, oh, but okay, not down okay. here. So just more storage for all utensils and so forth. Yeah. Rod lockers on the side.
it's a full walk around. Yeah. It makes it easy to handle. And no stop family. No steps either, which is nice. Oh, uh, and it's all swept, so it doesn't get real deep up here, so you can still fish or handle lines easily. Oh yeah. Cup holder rod holders. There's a 70 quart cooler built into this seat. Yeah, through the through through the bow anchor chute. So it can be wirelessly controlled. Nice seating for four and then a big layout pad. Yep. For the windshield, we've got a washer and wiper. A nice tower up top. Yeah, yeah. Tower's not quite finished up yet. We'll be finishing up after the show. Like I've shown earlier with the seatless design, there's no seams. And if you look up underneath the gunnel, oh, okay. it's all painted. Everything's finished all the way up and around. So there's no raw spots. And we do this all up in Stewart, Florida. Huh. So it's pretty cool because everything comes in on pallets and then it leaves on a semi truck looking like this. It's great. The next time I'm up that way, I maybe have to come by, pay a yeah, visit, for sure. show it behind the scenes. They call it a chemically hardened glass. They build molds. You can see that the back side's got some shape, the front side's a whole composite curve. Huh. It's built by a company called Procurve up there in Pennsylvania. But well, this will be finished, you'll be able to fully power it, everything up there. Beautiful view up top. And again, custom design, so anything you can think of, they can do for you.